Hello everybody, welcome back to another Adobe Photoshop 2022 tutorial. In this one, I'm going to show you how to get depth of field or the background blur. And I'm going to show you how to do it in like under a minute. It's really, really fast. And let me show you. Here it is. This is the shot. This is the revised shot. And I did it in 60 seconds. Let's go. Let's delete this layer and start from scratch. So here's our image. The first step you want to go through is you want to go up to filter and you want to go to your neural filters. Left click on neural filters and you're gonna get a whole bunch of different options. The one we want is down here under Depth Blur. If you haven't downloaded it yet, it will ask you to download it the first time you load it up. I'm gonna go ahead and look at that. I'm gonna turn on the toggle, and when you do that, you'll see at the bottom here, it's Processing on Device. It will automatically calculate to begin with, and it has actually done a very good job. If we, if we sort of zoom in here, you'll see that it has done a great job blurring it, but if you want to go ahead and make a few other changes, I recommend taking a quick look at the depth blur settings here. So I'm just clicking around through it. You can change the focal range and the focus subject. I'm not going to do that. However, I am going to show you blur strength to show you how this, you know, if you really want to get that deep blur in there, you can go ahead and do that by increasing the blur strength. Now let's just go ahead, it's, it's processing it, so that's why it's taking a little while there. And then presto, we've got an amazing, well we've got a really, really serious um, depth of field blur, but that's all you need to do it. If you want to go further and change a few of the colors or the color correction, the saturation, etc. It's kind of handy, you can do it all in the same place. But that's it guys, that's how you do it in 60 seconds. Thanks for watching, got a ton more stuff coming up, stay tuned.